everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin and my channel's name is My Randomly Organized Life. Just like the title of the video, I'm going to be sharing with you some of my favorites from the month of March and April. I didn't get a chance to film this in March, so I'm kind of just combining them together. And I didn't have a lot of new favorites but like to share for both months, so it kind of worked out to just combine them together into one video. Um, so I have them separated into categories and I'll go ahead and start sharing them with you. And I did want to say that I will try and link everything that I can down below in the description box. If I wasn't able to find a link, I'll just note it. Um, but I can say, you know, where I got it and things like that. So let's get started. All right. So first up is a necklace that was from my rocks box and it's this long one right here. I have to stand up to show you. Um, but it's just, it reminds me of an arrowhead. I really like this one. Um, I'll leave up here my Roxbox video where I share everything about what I got in that Roxbox and this necklace is included in that. Um, next up for beauty, I'll just stick with like beauty and fashion type category. But next up is this Dr. Brandt. It's the No More Baggage cream for your under your eyes. Um, and I got this in my, I believe my FabFitFun box. I wrote these down so I knew where they were from. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yep. This is from my FabFitFun box for spring. And I love this stuff. You guys, if you have a hard time going to sleep or waking up, or you just have a lot of kids like me and you just need a little help in the mornings. This stuff is great. Okay, so I have a couple things from my Ipsy bags. So this nail polish is from the March Ipsy bag. And this one was perfect for Easter. I wore this on Easter and it's just a good spring color. I really like it. And then the other item from Ipsy, this was from my April Ipsy bag. It's this lip oil. And in the video, I said that I wasn't sure if I would like it because it's so bright. But since it is a lip oil, it's basically more of like a gloss. I actually have it on today and you can't really tell that it's like super bold or anything. So I've really been liking this and it smells like watermelon. So it smells really good too. Um, next up is this Garnier Flat Iron Perfector. I've been using this every day that I straighten my hair and I've really been liking it. It helps keep it very straight and helps protect it from the heat of the straightener. So if you straighten your hair a lot, I would definitely suggest picking this up. And I just picked it up at Walmart. Um, I'm sure it's at Target or other retail stores um, like this that. This I got from Influencer. So it was sent to me to test out. It is a milk gel conditioner. So it's for fine and damaged hair. So I used to have really thick hair when I was younger. And since having kids and everything, my hair is really thinned out and then so I've had a hard time finding things that I like to help give my hair some volume. And I've been using this conditioner and I've really enjoyed using it. Um, I feel like I do need to use a lot, not a lot, I guess, but more than normal just because I have such long hair. Um, but I'm used to that with other conditioners as well. Um, but I really like the smell. Um, at first I didn't like the smell just because it kind of had just a weird scent to it. I just wasn't used to it. But after a few uses uses of it, I really do like the smell. And the smell stays in your hair for quite a while, which I really like that. Okay, so that was all the beauty-ish type stuff. So next up is like food and drink. Um, this is, I don't know if you have a high V around you, but we have high V's here in Iowa. And this sparkling water is the berry flavor. So I picked up this and then also the cucumber melon. These are the only two I've tried out of the hy V brand. And I know they have at least five other um, flavors, but these two are the only ones I've tried and I liked them both. If I had to pick a favorite, I would definitely pick the cucumber melon, especially going into the summer months. I feel like it's very refreshing and it's super delicious. Another food item is this Sam's Choice chocolate. So this is the 90% cocoa. Um, the reason I like this is one, it's chocolate. Everyone loves chocolate, but two, it's low carb. So it's only one carb, one net carb. So if you're doing any keto or anything like that, it's one net carb for three squares. And I usually just eat two. And for me, these are perfect for like a nighttime treat or something like that. If I'm craving something sweet. 
um, or just any time of the day, really. But I really like these. They're super cheap. They're just from Walmart. Um, I think it was like $2 or maybe just under $2. But compared to other chocolate bars that I've seen that are, you know, low carb and stuff like that, these are probably the cheapest and they're only one net carb. So that's, you can't really get lower than that unless you go to zero. So I would highly recommend these if you're looking for a low carb chocolate. All right, so I only have two more items here and they're more like household type items. So this is the Mrs. Meyers Clean Day uh, multi-surface multi -surface spray in Peony or Peony, however you want to say it. Um, but this is the Grove Collaborative um, Spring Scents. This is one of them. And this is the one I started off using first and I've really been loving it. I haven't started using my other ones yet just because I like to finish one set before opening up another one. But this is the one that I've really been liking so far. All right, last item is planner stickers. <laughs> so if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I love using my planner. And I do have a happy planner. And I picked these up, I want to say from Walmart. And I think they were like five bucks a piece. But what I really like about these is, so they're for the mini. I think this one's for the mini. This one I know is for the mini, but I don't have the mini and I still really like this. Um, I think this one might be the mini too. It doesn't, it doesn't say mini on it, but I really like this one too. This is the mom one. And I've just, I really love these. They have a good variety of stickers and for five bucks, a whole pack of these, that's pretty cheap. Um, so I like making my own stickers as far as my weekly spreads go, but I really like these for just stickers to fill in throughout. So like these have little quotes. Um, they have like weekend banners and glasses and food for like dinners and things and the holidays. Um, and then these ones are just anything mom related. So basically if you have kids, dentist appointments, sporting events, things like that. This is all in there. So I really like these. All right, you guys, that was everything for my favorites for March and April. Again, I combined them because I didn't have a lot for either month and I just didn't have time to film it in March. Um, so I just combined them all into one video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I'd love for you to subscribe and join our YouTube family. And if you have any comments or anything, definitely leave those down below. And I'd love to know what some of your favorites are from the last couple months so I can try them out as well. I love finding new favorites. And again, I will try and link as much as I can down below. So if you wanted to check it out, you can do that. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.